Hi, I'm Kelsey Dinahan, Avon Celebrity Makeup Artist, and I'm here with Jenny from Avon. Hi, Kelsey. Thanks for coming today. Of course. Now, why do you have a makeup artist here with you in your office? Well, because before I left the house today, I wanted to highlight and contour my face, but I really wanted the professional to come in and show everybody how to actually do it. Perfect. You did this half your face. You can see it's really kind of sculpted on the cheek. It's not too dramatic. It just gives that little sculpt and shading. Use the Avon True Color contour stick, and I'm just gonna draw a line right like this down towards the corner of her mouth. The great thing about this is it does dry, so you wanna blend it really quickly so it stays exactly where you put it all day long. Longevity is key. And then I'm gonna bring it up just slightly into the temple, just the, what's the remainder on the brush. And again, just kinda of circle it in, and that's just gonna kinda of cut this and really sculpt the forehead. Put a little right down here on the jawline. It's gonna give a really sharp angle. And then a little bit right here on the nose. And again, blending that in. So then I'm gonna flip the stick over <laughs> to the lighter side, which is gonna be our one of our highlights. Add a little bit right here on the high cheekbone, down the bridge of the nose. And a little bit just slightly under, just to kind of really emphasize the darkness. And again, I'm just gonna blend out with the brush. You can draw on your face, then blend it out. You can use the brush and kind of wiggle it across. You'll have more control if you um, want to use the brush like this, that way you can just kind of keep it going in really circular motions. Uh, if you want to draw on your face and then blend it out, it's totally up to you. That's the great thing about this. You can use it any way you want. So I'm going to go in now with the powder highlight. And I'm going to just follow where I put the, cray the light crayon. And I'm going to put this right on the high cheekbone. It's going to give just a really natural glow. And a little down the bridge of the nose just to kind of like emphasize where we put that highlight. Okay, and that is all you need to learn to do a whole daytime contour look. It's not some big, like, extravagant thing, like just a couple few easy steps, and you're good to go for a daytime look. I heard you're going out tonight. It's my anniversary tonight. So how do you feel about really kind of sculpting and contouring, and kind of going all out and showing the difference between a daytime and nighttime look? That would be amazing. All right, let's do it. Ready? Let's do it. One, two, three. And with the power of movie magic, I am now at your anniversary dinner with you. I'm gonna show you just how to intensify your contour and then add a bunch of highlight to really show off your face. I can't wait. So we're gonna take your same medium contour stick. And instead of using the stick on the skin, just because I'm intensifying what we've already done, yeah. I'm just gonna kind of run the brush over it, go right over where we've already placed under the cheek, down the nose, and again up in here on the temples. And then the hero product of the night are the illuminating highlighting sticks. So again, I'm just gonna use a brush over the product and down the center of the nose, high cheekbones. And since we did do a red lip, I'm gonna put a little bit of this product right on the cupid's bow, a little under the brow, Anywhere we put the light highlight of the crayon, we're gonna add the cream illuminator. So using the illuminating stick, we've shown you an easy way to go from day to night, and now you are all ready to enjoy your anniversary dinner alone. I'll leave you alone. <laughs> Goodbye, I'm Thank sorry. Thank you, Kelsey.